22 is about to begin. There's been thunderstorms, there's been hail that's missed us, thank goodness. And now we can start. This is a six acre field that we're starting in. Number two has started. Hey folks, Scott with SNC Livestock. Not sure if any of you know any of you folks know what this is, but this is my medication delivery device. <laughs> Fancy. This is my dart gun. I've got my mama number two cow out there this morning. She come down and uh, she was limping hard on her front right leg. This is a new dart dart gun. Um, so anyways, we're going to administer her some meds. She's going to get uh, some meloxicam via dart, and she's going to get some biomycin as well. So anyways, that's what we're up to. We're going to go over. Uh, Ideally, she should get probably about 50 to 60 cc's of the biomycin. And, uh, but, uh considering I'm low on darts. She'll be getting 30 and she'll get 20 of the meloxicam. And, uh, and if need be, I'll top her up tomorrow on the biomycin. So anyways, that's what we're up to right now. We're gonna go over. I just filled the, uh, the clip with uh, the rounds for her and we'll go and get her uh, treated and get her back on her way of being healthy. Talk to you soon. Well, look what we got here. Our chickens finally made it to their tractor. So we got them out of the brooder and we got the horrible Hennessy who's just trying to round them up. He doesn't know any different. Anyways, hen's trying to round the chicks. We actually just put them in and they're doing really good. Loving being on the grass. 
Um, yeah, so here's our first night. We'll let you know, actually, we'll, we'll check back in with you to let you know how they did. Let's see if the other serial killers, okay. We've got one serial killer here. And I don't know where the second one is. Is he over on the other side? I'm not sure. We had two of them stalking. Anyway, so yeah, here they are. Doing good, pasture. Oh, look at the little buggers. Pasture-raised poultry here, going on. All right, folks. Hi, guys. Just a little update on the video, because um, I just uh, seen our cows back here. It's a hot day. I think it's like 27, feeling like 30. They're calling for some thunder showers, but it's hot. And the flies, the black flies in the cows are crazy. It's a sin, sin, sinful. Um, we do give them the garlic block to lick. Hi, Curly. Poor thing. Oh, my goodness. Come here, girl. Come here, Curly girl. Poor girl. Hi, Curls. Yeah. Hey, she's so, such a good girl. She did well this uh, summer so far. We have a short time with nice weather, but they've uh, done pretty well. All right, girls. Here, let's get this off. <clears throat> here. So yeah, so everyone's around here. We treated um, a little lady yesterday, number two. So that's why I thought I'd just be out here and have a look to see if she's out here. And we seen her last night and she actually fared pretty well. She was not limping as much. And so I'm just trying to see if I can have a look at her and see if she's walking pretty good today. We treated her with some pain medication and also some biomycin. Um, and, uh, yeah, but I don't see her and I mainly keep, the, um, you know, our cows are pretty good, but yeah, I think you've heard me say before, Miss Tessa girl, she's, she's our not so nice cow. So, um, that's why I keep my stick with me. And actually there's a couple of, uh, steers you know they're just like teenagers jerks so i just keep my my stick from that like mr number five our steer he's just a little too darn friendly and uh he likes his head scratches and then he wants to keep going for more and takes it a little too far now there's my Tessa girl's steer from last year. Oh, he's so full of flies, sinful. So this is just actually right behind our house. Um, not gonna show you the garden because, um, yeah, I neglectfully didn't weed this year. Just a few circumstances happened and um, but potatoes are growing good. I'll say that. So if we get a few potatoes, that will be good. It's in there, the garden amongst those weeds. Uh, let me see. There's a few moms. They like to stay down here. In the shade, it's a little. There's some up there. Um, hi, Mom. Yep, 
Is that you, Mama? No. Hmm. Some of our tags have uh, the numbers sort of sponged off, or what I guess you can't really quite tell. See, there's Mr. Five. He's just a little too friendly. You stay back, boy. Come on. Oh, it flies around. Him. So. Yeah. He just, especially with a quad, he likes to challenge the quad. And uh, he's a friendly boy. And there's Mermy's little baby in there. And that's Miss Kay. I don't know if you can see her. Way underneath. There's six. All the little babies are spread out here. Smart babies. So there's six. I'm just seeing if her little baby's here because number two I'm looking for. And I don't know if you guys remember my baby, my bottle baby Kong. Um, and that would be baby six there. She, he, I guess I called him, that's his sister because the mama took over, which is awesome. And that's who he goes to, mama, for um, his milk, which is awesome. Saves me. And he just got lovely integrated right into the herd. So it was actually really good. Sorry, boy, I don't mean to, oh, it's a girl, Callie. Um, anyone know anything about mushrooms? Um, I'd like to know if these are good to eat or would they be good to microdose? Ha ha ha. Anyways, yeah, we got some mushrooms here growing all down around here. Anyways, I can't find her and I keep interrupting their time in the shade. So I'm just going to go here. Um, great talking to you and hopefully Scott will be back on and giving you an update on, hey, how that's going. All right, talk to you later. So I guess I should have updated just two on our chickens. So the chickens now have gone out on to our front lawn and they will be moved every day twice a day and we're raising some um, meat kings here so here they are here's their tractor I don't know if I can give you a visual uh, I think I got it in there and here is their tractor I'm just gonna open up the lid Here they all, there's 50 in there. So they're doing pretty good. I think they're about four weeks right now. They're nicely feathered. And we put them out last night and they quite enjoy it. So I just want to update you on that. They grow so quick. Nicer food. So, yeah, there is our chicken tractor. I'll just put this down. And there they are. All right, folks. Hey, guys. Scott with s and Livestock. Welcome back. Well, there we are. It's that time. Time to shake, rattle, and roll with the 855. First bail bailed, and the son of a bitch didn't tie. Pissed off. Decent bail, too. Look at that. Nice and tight. A little bit of twine in there somewhere. She's got a fleck of taunt twine some places. Nice and tight bail. Good looking stuff. 
and that son of a bitch. I guess you gotta have some trial and error. Well, off we go again. Give her shit. So Scott's getting the big field done here. Um, still going, still got up on the hill here left to do. Um, Bale County, Fox 